Welcome to this tutorial on making adjustments to 360 degree images in Affinity Photo for iPad. First, we load a photo from our camera roll. To view our image in 360, we go to the Commands menu, Projection, and choose Equirectangular Projection. I want to lighten up the image because this area is too dark. Before I make any changes, I need to go to the Commands menu, choose Projection and Clear Projection so there's no projection displayed. Confirm background layers chosen in Layer Studio. Now we're ready to make adjustments on our flat 360 image. So we go into the Adjustments Studio and select the adjustment that we want to make. My first one is Levels, so I make those adjustments. Satisfied with my Levels adjustments, I next go to Shadow and Brightness. Each time you use one of these different adjustment tools, it's creating a layer in your image. Lastly, I go to the Brightness and Contrast Adjustment. Finally, in Layer Studio, I confirm that the, these layers were added and that background layer is chosen before I go to the Commands menu and choose Flatten to merge these layers all together. I then go to the Commands menu and choose Projection, Equa Rectangular Projection, to check my work. Before I save my work, I need to go back to the Commands menu, Projection, and clear the projection so that the flattened image will be saved. I then go to the Documents menu and choose Export. I rename the file. Click on the Share button to save it to my camera roll. And then I cancel. I exit Affinity and switch to Insta360 Player to confirm that my edits didn't destroy the 360 capabilities of the file. Satisfied that the file is working properly, I'm ready to upload it to Facebook. <laughs> 